Hello, I am Dr. Dhruv Chaturvedi. I am a senior consultant neurosurgeon at Vimhans Neti Hospital in Delhi. I have received my training from All India Institute of Medical Sciences and after that I have received further training from Queen Elizabeth Hospital, Birmingham. Today on the day of World Brain Tumor Day, I'd like to address the issue a little bit and make you guys aware of the various uh, signs and symptoms as well as the treatment that we can offer for brain tumors. No age is exempt from brain tumor. It is seen in children, adults as well as in the elderly people. And these days, now with the advent of newer technologies like MRI, we are finding more and more cases of brain tumor. Brain tumor is one of the most cancerous tumor, but the, not all brain tumors are cancerous. Rather, more than 60% of the brain tumors are non-cancerous. Brain tumors can affect in any, any age group. It is very common in children also. We must be aware of the signs and symptoms of a brain tumor. Brain tumor can give you headache, disturbances in visions, weakness in any part of the body like your arm or leg. It can give you seizures. It can give you difficulty in speech, imbalance and lots and lots of other symptoms. So if you have any of these symptoms, you must approach your primary physician who would examine you and if he feels okay, he would uh, request you for an MRI or a CT scan. Now, as I said, two third of these tumors are non-cancerous. Some of these tumors are removed surgically and we have to undertake an operation. Whereas a few tumors can be dealt with medically and can be treated by medicines. Regarding the surgeries, not all brain tumor surgeries are very extensive and these days we have very good outcomes and results for brain tumor surgeries, especially for the non-cancerous tumors. But even in the cancerous tumors, we have been able to prolong the life expectancy after surgery. In addition to the surgery, the patients may need radiotherapy and chemotherapy for long term uh, in the cancerous tumors, whereas in the benign tumors or the non-cancerous tumors, surgery is generally sufficient. The outcome depends on whether it is a cancerous tumor or a non-cancerous tumor. As I told you earlier also, the outcome in non-cancerous tumors is pretty good and the life expectancy at, in many a cases is not affected at all. Whereas in the cancerous tumors, it depends on the grade of the tumor as to whether it is highly cancerous or low cancer. Thank you.